Now, in what appears to be the strategy to first track the process of graduates getting employed with ease, the government has rolled out an elaborate plan to enable students from universities and mid-level colleges to get employment upon graduation. Speaking today as she launched the Office of Career Services Education Cabinet Secretary, Ambassador Amina Mohammed said the role of government in conjunction with the university management will be will be exposed will be to expose students to job opportunities besides enhancing smooth access to employment by placing strategic and deliberate meetings between students and heads of human resources from different companies. Further, every university will be required to organize for meetings between students and top-notch employers with the view of allowing them to speak to, us, to the students as a way of exposing them to the existing job opportunities. But the student leaving the gates of the university, going out onto the street, is actually facing a very difficult situation. This is a very scary world for them. And uh, we take it for granted that they can cope. But most of the times, they are not able to cope. So it would be obvious to anybody who interacts with the students immediately after graduation that they need a lot of assistance. On the other hand, the students often come back to us then. After they have gone out and they find it is very hot there, they come back to us and they say, now, uh, Professor, can you help? That is another problem by itself, because we don't have the structures to help them. So we don't even know exactly how we should help this student. We agree that we have to focus on a few things. The first one was the need to enhance youth employability by addressing the skills mismatch between education and labor. And we knew that this would involve the provision of training and work experience that is relevant to market needs, not only in the formal sector, by the way, because that's a poor employer, as we have already established, but also in formal sector. The second step we thought about was to support job creation by actually preparing the learners for self-employment. And the third was to enhance uh, labor market information and its access to the students, guide learning institutions as well as the learners regarding the opportunities that are present in today's market, as well as those that will be present in tomorrow's market. And I think we all know that the market is dynamic, it's changing, and one has to adapt to that, and my colleagues have already referred to that need for adoption. The career, the Office of Career Services, ladies and gentlemen, seeks to cater for these critical requirements that we have talked about. It's uh, expected to partner with an array of organizations and to serve at the intersection between skills, employment, market knowledge, innovation, industry, and government. The core responsibilities of this office will include the following. Partnering with industry to provide internship, apprenticeship, training and job opportunities for students. It's not possible to acquire experience in your institutions of high learning. That's not possible. So you actually need the exposure to the job market through internships, apprenticeships, and CAM is already doing a wonderful job of that. And we have a few other organizations that have already started working on that. Some we asked to do that because we wanted to actually see whether what we were doing would have the impact that we wanted to have.